All right, so how do you get goat horns? So here behind me, we have a bunch of goats. Uh, I summoned them myself for the sake of the tutorial video. And you see on top of them, they have horns. Now you cannot get them by harvesting them off of their heads, right? Uh, you, some of these are already missing horns. You're screaming at me. <laughs> so you want the goats to try to ram you, right? And they sometimes do it when you're not looking. So I'm in survival right here. And this is easier if you have friends. So I would suggest you have friends. The thing, oh, ouch. You see how he ran to me? That's only half of the job. This is easier if you go into F5 mode and you want them to ram you. And when they try to ram you, you want to suddenly jump out of the way. Ah, I didn't do it. But see, you want to try to get out of the way and then have them hit a wall. So, you know, have them follow you and come to a wall. C come here, goats. Come here. Uh, you can you can do it at wall, any wall. You, you want to make your walls. Stone walls are good. Cobblestone. Any hard walls. Oh, ouch. The screaming goats. It's always the wrong one. But see, you want them to hit that wall. What happens is once they hit that wall, they will get rid of one of their horns. Here. Goat. Goats. Goats. Come follow me. Come follow me. Oh, did you see that? His horn popped off. Yay. Okay. Well, I need to explain a few mistakes I made the last time. Um, it's important that when you do this, a goat has to hit a block that spawned naturally and you didn't place. So you saw that wall I placed earlier. Yeah, that doesn't work. So if you dig in the ground instead and then do it, so I didn't place any of these blocks, then it will work. Uh, and stone is the best. You want it to be stone. It can hit other solid blocks like coal or packed ice, but stone is the best, okay? Um, but yeah, that's how you get the goat horn. Um, easier, you know, if there's a few more, it's easier. And you watch for it to start lowering its head. And when it does that, that's when you want to quickly jump out of the way and let it hit the block. Anyways, we got one and... <laughs> that's how you play the horn. And there's multiple different horns with different sounds that they can make. But uh, anyways, yeah. So that's that's how you get the goat horn. Oh, uh, you got to be, uh, was it, four, between four and 16 blocks. And then every 30 to 300 seconds is when a goat looks around for a player that's not moving. And that's the other mistake. You cannot be moving. And it's more likely to happen if you're looking away from the goat, though it's supposed to be just if you're not moving. So that's why I hit F5 so I can look behind me. It's actually easier to jump out of the way and see that way. Um, the other thing is you cannot be in peaceful. If you're in peaceful, they will not charge you. Interesting, right? Okay, there we go. But at least you understand now how to get a goat horn.